Welcome back to my channel and welcome if you're new here. My name is Jen. I'm a certified weight loss and nutrition coach and I'm on the WW or the Weight Watchers Blue Plan. Today I have a huge and I mean huge Dollar Tree snack video. So I went to the Dollar Tree just to see what they had and I came out with not one, not two, not three, not four, but five bags of WW friendly Dollar Tree snacks. So if you're excited for today's video, give it a big huge thumbs up. And don't forget if you're new or you haven't yet subscribed, of course I'd love to have you here. Hit the subscribe button and click the bell right next to it so you never miss a single video. Down in the description box, you will find nutrition coaching. I do offer personalized to you macros and calories. Highly recommend taking advantage of this service just so you know where you should fall every day calorie and macronutrient wise to see the most success. If you want to chat with me directly, I offer one-on-one -on -one coaching as well. Links, discounts to all my favorite things and my Facebook group, head on over, join us there, are all down in that description box. So let's jump in to this huge, massive Dollar Tree snack video. Before we get started, I wanted to preface this video with these snacks aren't real whole clean food. Now some of them have pretty good clean ingredients, but let's be honest, what you're going to find at the Dollar Tree most likely will be more on the process side. Now no food is bad or good, and if it's in your budget to buy your snacks at the Dollar Tree, then absolutely do that. I find that they have a wide variety of really good delicious snacks. And like I've mentioned several times, I'm 82. 20, 80% nice clean whole food and 20% foods that I love like Dollar Tree snacks. As always, I will be putting all of the points here on the screen for you. The first item I found was this chicken salad kit. So this is a little can of chicken salad with crackers. Now they also had tuna and I thought that a dollar was a pretty good deal for this. And this is actually a somewhat healthy snack or lunch. So you receive the can of chicken salad, the condiment and the crackers. They're ready to eat. They don't have to be refrigerated. They'd be great to throw in your purse, your car, or in your desk or at work. Number two are these Good Health Organic Cheese Crisps. I picked up this brand in my last Dollar Tree snack video and both Troy and I absolutely loved them. But these ones are different. These are the baked cheese puffs in mac and cheese flavor. These actually have decent ingredients and a lot of the ingredients are organic. You get two cups or one ounce for the smart points. They are 150 calories per serving. If these are as good as the other ones I picked up, I'm pretty excited. Next are these Sun Best Fruit Filled Biscuits. Now it's two biscuits per serving, so that's pretty good for 110 calories and the points here on the screen. I thought that these would be, again, a great snack, something you could throw in your purse, your car, or leave in your desk drawer at work, and they would be a really good, easy, convenient breakfast on the go. Along those same lines, I found these fruit and grain bars. I picked up the strawberry. They did have apple and blueberry as well. So these are a spinoff of the Nutri-Grain bar. They're 130 calories, and again, a convenient easy on-the-go breakfast, an easy snack to throw in your desk drawer or in your car, and these are actually really good. And one thing these have going for them is at least they're made with some whole grains. Bag number two, this bag is apparently the bag of chips. Starting with these Good Health Veggie Chips. This is the same brand that made those chips that I just showed you, the mac and cheese one. This brand is really, really delicious. These are non-GMO and gluten-free veggie crisps. One ounce or 30 crisps is 150 calories, so not bad at all. I like the chip style as well because you can actually dip these in hummus or your favorite dip and you can't beat it for a dollar. Next up are these Mighty Rights apple flavored baked puffs. Now in my last video, I also had some puffs from this same brand, but they were cheesy and they were savory and they were so good. I have to say that I've been pleasantly surprised at how good of quality some of these snacky things are at the Dollar Tree. So this time I decided to pick up an apple flavored or maybe a sweeter versus savory flavored puff. One ounce, 28 grams is 140 calories, so not bad at all. And there's three servings in this bag for a dollar. I saw that they had Lay's Stacks 
What I like about these is this plastic container that they come in. So they don't get crushed or shattered and you can keep these in places again, like your car or in your desk drawer at work. They had several flavors of the lace stacks. I picked up the sour cream and onion just because I know that Troy will really like these, but there were barbecue and cheddar and plain. For a dollar is not bad. 12 crisps is only 140 calories. Bag number three. These Imperial Nut Fruit and Nut Mix definitely caught my eye. There's three servings per container. A serving is a quarter of a cup and it's only 110 calories. And I thought this would be a really good, satisfying, cleaner snack. In particular one, the fruit and nut blend has raisins, golden raisins, cranberries, cashews, and almonds. I love trail mix. I can overeat trail mix, so I just have to make sure that I weigh these out, pre-package them up, and have the single serve containers ready to go. They had lots and lots of trail mix options. Now this product really, really caught my eye. These are the Real Cocoa Coconut Chips. So these are gluten-free. There's two servings in the bag and half of the bag is only 110 calories. And here's your ingredients, coconut meat, cane sugar, and salt. So really good, clean ingredients in these, nothing processed or no preservatives. They're non-GMO, no cholesterol, and a good source of fiber. So I was excited to have these. These would be great to top an acai bowl or just to snack on. Half of this bag for the points and calories. Now I showed these in my last Dollar Tree snack video, but in case you missed it, these definitely deserve a second mention. So if you watched my big massive grocery haul, you saw that I bought the big bag of these coconut rolls at Costco. They're already gone. Both Troy and I absolutely love these. So this smaller bag is only a dollar, which is such a great price for these. There's two servings per bag and each serving is 144 calories. Again, we have nice clean ingredients, coconut milk, tapioca flour, sugar, egg, water, salt, and black sesame seeds. So this is another clean food option for a dollar. And did I mention? incredibly delicious. Next are these mini bars, pumpkin seeds and nuts. Now I picked up a different flavor of these in a previous video and they are really, really delicious. So these are little granola bar type of bites. You get three pieces for 170 calories and there's three servings in the bag. So again, these are a nice hearty snack or on the go breakfast. You could even pair these with a string cheese or a hard boiled egg. And again, it would be a really, really good breakfast or snack. Next up are these cinnamon granola bites. I purchased the chocolate chip ones before in a previous haul and they were really delicious. I'm a big fan of little granola bites, just really easy, portable, snacky things. This bag has two and a half servings. One serving is six of the little granola bites for 125 calories. Like I mentioned, I picked up the chocolate chip ones in a previous haul and they were delicious. And I thought that this cinnamon one would just be a nice change of pace. So if you see these type of granola bites at your Dollar Tree, definitely pick them up because these are quite pricey in the traditional grocery store. And the last item in this bag is biscotti. I absolutely love biscotti. So these are the original recipe biscotti. So these are fairly small, but a serving size is five of them for 110 calories and you get six servings for a dollar. What I like to do with biscotti is dip it in hot coffee or hot cocoa. They're a pretty hard cookie, but when you dip them, it just brings in the flavor of that coffee or hot chocolate, softens them up, and they're so, so good. And biscotti is a great option for kind of a sweet treat because generally they are pretty low in calories and points. Bag number four. So the first item in this bag are these yogurt filled cookies. One of my other favorite things about snacks from the Dollar Tree is most of them are pre-portioned out. So it's harder to overeat if they're pre-portioned out for you. And that's the case with these yogurt filled cookies. They come in blueberry yogurt, strawberry yogurt, peach yogurt, and vanilla yogurt. There are four cookies per pack and they are only 140 calories for four cookies. And again, because they're pre-portioned out, it just makes it a lot less hard to overeat because I don't know about you, but I can eat a lot of cookies. Next up are these Werther's Original Caramel Apple Candies. In my last Dollar Tree snack video, I picked up a couple of the sugar-free Werther's. I'm just not a big fan of sugar-free really anything. So when I saw these caramel-filled non-sugar-free ones and saw how low in calories they were, I was 
certain that the points wouldn't be bad for these either. Two pieces is only 50 calories and there's six servings in this bag. You can't beat it for a dollar. These are individual packaged little candies. One or two cures your sweet tooth and who doesn't love a good caramel apple. Next up are these strawberry filled mini muffins. How fun and how perfect are these for kids or husbands in my case. Troy was pretty excited to have these in his lunch. Each little mini muffin is individually wrapped. There's five muffins in the box. They're 110 calories a piece and they are filled with raspberry. Now I will tell you that I tried this. I found it to be a little bit on the dry side, but if you pop it in your microwave for a couple seconds, that, that really helps it out a lot. But it was really good. It had good flavor. They're pre-packaged, so it's perfect for a quick, easy, on-the-go snack. Next up are these vanilla flavored animal cookies. Again, pre-packaged, stops you from overeating these, and these are animal crackers, but covered in some fun vanilla glaze. Each little packet contains 14 cookies, is 110 calories, and there's six servings per box. Again, great for your kids' lunches. I'm gonna throw these in Troy's lunch. Great snack to have in your car or your purse. Again, I love the pre-portioned, pre-packaged snacks at the Dollar Tree, and I also love that they're so incredibly affordable. Six packages for one dollar. And last but not least are these cute PJ Masks on the go cookie pack. So these are duplex sandwich cookies, kind of like Oreo slash golden Oreo. One side has a chocolate cookie, one side has a vanilla cookie. They're individually packaged, two cookies, per pack for 80 calories. And there's eight individual two cookie serving packs per box. And bag number five. First up are these Harvest Snap Peas and White Cheddar. I actually really, really love these. These are so good. These green pea snap crisps. They had white cheddar, plain. They had a bold and spicy one. There's one serving technically in the bag. The calories are 260, but you could easily divide this bag into two servings. It'll only be 130 calories per serving. And these are just a really good crispy snack. Next up is dry roasted edamame. So I found these over with the trail mix section. I always am on the lookout for nuts at the Dollar Tree because nuts are expensive. They're a great snack. They're high in protein and healthy fats, but they're pricey. So if you can find them at the Dollar Tree, it's a huge win. This edamame is a quarter cup for a serving. There's three and a half servings per bag and it's 140 calories per serving. So if you're wanting nuts, some crunch, some healthy fats and protein, I was pretty excited about this and I love edamame. Next up are these Junior Dippers, cheese dip and breadsticks. If this doesn't bring you back to your childhood, I don't know what would, but these little breadsticks and cheese are so good. They're so processed, but they're so good. Troy, again, was excited to see these. I'm going to put these in his lunch. Great for a kid's lunch. Great for a quick, easy, on-the-go snack. They're individually packaged, so there's a pack of breadsticks and a pack of cheese in it, the individual package. They're only 70 calories a piece, so the whole pack, breadsticks and cheese, is only 70 calories. Next are these just crispy dried mangoes. This is another item I always, always pick up at the Dollar Tree and that's dried fruit. I do not count points for dried fruit if there's no added sugar. And in this one, it says ingredients mango. It's 70 calories for the entire pack, which is actually less calories than if you ate a fresh mango. So I don't count points for this. I do count the calories. And again, dried fruit is just a quick, easy snack. It's ready to go, doesn't require cutting up or refrigeration or peeling. So whenever I find a good price on dried fruit, especially at the Dollar Tree, I pick it up. So these looked really good. This is the Farmer's Pantry Cornbread Crisp. These are in the honey butter flavor. It says there's 10 grams of whole grains, one ounce or 32 crisps, half the bag essentially, is 130 calories. So I thought that these would be really good paired with chili or soup or just again as a crunchy sweet snack. They had a couple other different flavors as well, but I thought that this honey butter sounded amazing. Next are these Krispies oven baked rice crisps. So these remind me of the Quaker little mini rice cakes and it's only a dollar per bag. There are two and a half servings. Each serving is a 15 crisp, so really comparable to the Quaker, 110 calories. I picked up the caramel for that fun little sweet treat. They did have some savory flavors as well, but I know the Quaker ones can be upwards of $3 a bag. So if you can get the same thing at the Dollar Tree for a dollar, heck yes. I was pretty excited to see these two. I 
love Ritz, pretty much anything. These are the Ritz cheese crispers. So they had a couple of flavors. They had the cheddar and then this four cheese and herb. There are two servings per bag, 21 chips per serving for 140 calories. Again, Ritz are one of my favorites. I love the snapped, the little crispers. I just love that cheesy cracker vibe with a salad or a sandwich for lunch. So just be mindful that there is two servings per bag. So what I generally do will pre is I will pre-portion out the two servings. So again, I'm not tempted to overeat and eat this whole bag. And the last item I had to pick up are these Sour Patch Kid Frozen Ice Bars. So these are Sour Patch Kid Freezer Bars, kind of like Otter Pops, but better because they're Sour Patch Kids. They come in red berry and blue raspberry. There's 10 freezer pops per box. Entire box, they say, is a serving. Who's gonna eat 10 freezer pops in one serving? If you did, it's 180 calories for all 10 pops, so that makes them 18 calories a piece, which is fantastic for a sweet, cold summer treat. So we made it to the end of that huge, massive Dollar Tree snack haul. I hope that I gave you just a ton of ideas for a really affordable price. I love the Dollar Tree. I love it for makeup, snacks. I love to do Dollar Tree what I eat in a days. In fact, I have an entire Dollar Tree budget meal playlist. I will link it down below for you. I think this is the third Dollar Tree snack video I've done. So lots of fun budget related content for you to watch. So if you enjoyed this snack haul, give it a big thumbs up and if you're new or you haven't yet subscribed make sure you subscribe and ring the bell next to it so you never miss a single video i've been doing these dollar tree snack videos and what i eat in a days and i'm loving them and you're loving them so make sure you're subscribed so you don't miss a single one links discounts to my favorite things my facebook group and nutrition coaching are all down in the description box happy budget shopping next time you head to the dollar tree see you next time bye